Windows ADK is a collection of tools and technologies produced by Microsoft designed to help deploy Microsoft Windows operating system images to target computers or to a virtual hard disk image in VHD format. With ADK tools, you can service and deploy various Windows versions all the way from Windows 7 to 11 using a single tool. You can add drivers, applications, change settings, add new policies and updates. You might be familiar with NT Lite, Win Toolkit, W10 UI and MSMG Toolkit which uses ADK tools and commands internally with a better easy to use UI. In this video I'll be covering minimal installation of newer DISM version and how to make new version of DISM as default. Let's get started. I will add links in the description. I will download the online installer of ADK and start installing it. I will be unchanged decking all other options except deployment tools with download size of 100 to 200 megabytes. I will speed up the video. We will check the installed version and location using Win Toolkit. Next, we will replace the default DISM version with the new version using an alias through PowerShell in elevated mode. Now, we will add an alias to DISM pointing to installed location. We'll verify if the alias is linked properly by running get alias command followed by name of the alias. Let's recheck through PowerShell and it uses latest version. This step is optional in case if you want to revert to system version we can use the command remove alias if you're using PowerShell 6 and above versions. In case if you're on older version of PowerShell, you can use Dell alias to remove the alias. We'll check the output of get alias first. Looks like there are no alias assigned to DISM. We can try calling DISM command which has reverted to old version shipped with build 19000. With this we have reached the end of the video. Don't forget to share your thoughts in the comment section, and if you found this helpful, Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Recently, hit 71 subs and you can support me on Patreon and Topmate with links in about page. Thank you once again to all my subscribers and the community for your continued support.